Two outs, 3 1 count on Stan. Pitch. Flip it down. Hits Stanton, and Stanton gives a little look, and now has some to say to Mike Fires. And now Stanton going to take. A step towards him as the benches will start to trickle out. Stanton will go towards first as James McCann walks him there. Not the first time that Fires has hit Stanton, and the first time was career threatening. So there's a history there between these two. Let's go back when Stanton was with the uh, Marlins, and Fires was with the Milwaukee Brewers. You can see Fires' reaction. Stanton's season was ended as he was hit in the face with a fastball. And if you don't think he remembers that, even though this one is not near the face and in the elbow, he remembers. Yeah, you never forget that. And Stanton had. Quite a bit to say to Fires. Now, I, I'm not sure exactly what's happening here, Kenny. I didn't see any warnings. I was watching Stanton, so I'm not sure. A, there was no overt warning shown by Alan Porter, the home plate umpire. But then Miguel Cabrera came off of first to discuss something with Ron Gardenhire, it looked like. Now Bill Miller is talking with Ron Gardner. He's the crew chief. Yeah, he is. Of course, when we were here last Ooh. August, these teams engaged in a legitimate and lengthy brawl with the benches clearing several times. Uh -huh. No way. I'm not trying to hit you. So no way I'm not trying to hit you. Yeah. It's hard to convince a hitter who's been hit in the face by a pitcher that uh, I don't think he was trying to hit him either. His displeasure with getting hit and his reaction had a lot to do, you think, with who it was, and he's going to like that. And he is going to make sure and stylize that trot. A bomb off the bat of John Carlos Stanton as he wins this battle with Mike Fires. And he gives a little point back to Mike Fires after he crosses home. O2 pitch. Here's another look. Classic hanging breaking ball. Right in the happy zone. There was a bat flip after this. Well, look at him just watching it. Took a look at fires. Tossed it aside. Enjoyed the trot and then even pointed to fires after he crossed home. After being hit I've never been hit like that. Yeah. But I've been hit before. And it, it's scary up around the shoulders. But you can't think about that. He's right. You can't think about it. You won't be able to hit if, you, if you're thinking about that. If it's in your mind, you won't be able to do your job. Yeah, if it's going to come up and in like that, then yeah, it does. Uh, wasn't trying to hit me in that situation, but um, still, with, with the history like it, what happened, um, you know, don't hit me. Is there any better revenge than a 456 foot homer? Um, it was nice. Uh, win would be better, but um, oh well. Did you get your elbow pad there? Uh, forearm. Forearm. Yeah. Did you have thoughts of actually going to the mound, or you you were just walking and kind of you just wanted to get a couple of things off your chest? Just and... Say what you need to say, and you know, uh, get to the next guy. Hopefully. Um, we can get get some runs going and you know not stir anything up that's not trying to help us win at the end of the day. Yeah, I did.
Why, why not? <laughs> Is that one of your better bat flips of all time? Sure. Do you expect, you know, if you do face him again, whether it's... It doesn't matter. We'll get there when we get there, and when we are there, it won't matter either, so... What was, what was the message and the point? Get the point. The way he handled it, I think it was kind of childish. I mean, you know, anybody knows, you know, watching this game that, you know, I'm not throwing at him. Um, so, you know, he's going to act how he's going to act and, you know, but it kind of shows kind of his character because obviously I wasn't throwing at him. Uh, pitch was pitch was in and, you know, if I could throw, if I could throw a pitch anywhere I wanted every time, I'd, you know, I'd probably be one of the best pitchers in this game. So, um, you know, I got to throw in, I got to throw up, I got to, I got to throw it everywhere and keep these guys, you know, from, you know, making good contact with it. And um, you know, so, so be it. You know, I, like I said, I'm not trying to hit anybody, but, you know, I definitely got to throw in. And, you know, that thing, those things happen every once in a while. You were surprised by the exchange, weren't you? Um, not really surprised. I mean, like I said, I, I understand the history and I understand that it was a, a bad moment for him a while ago. So, you know, I understand he's upset, but I just think um, the way he handled it after is... I don't know, a little childish. Uh, are you talking the childish part, like pointing to you after the home run or before when you hit him? I don't know. Just, yeah, I mean, getting his revenge and, you know, throwing his bat and pointing, I mean, <laughs> it's that's not part of this game. I mean, yeah, you're supposed to have fun, but, I mean, I think that's kind of childish. But I understand he was happy at that point, and he got me back, but, I mean, whatever. Would you have liked to face him again if, if you could have, if the game would have allowed it? Yeah, I mean, um, we go to New York too, so I might have to pitch there. So um, <laughs> I still got to gotta pitch to him just like I pitched to everybody else. So, I mean, um, I might have to face him again. Did he say anything to you after you hit him? Yeah, he's just, well, yeah, he's upset. He's, he's upset because of the history, and rightfully so. But, um, you know, he's got to understand it's not on purpose. And... Especially in that, I mean, that you just look at the situation, you look at what's going on in the game, people on base, the score, um, <laughs> not trying to hit them there. And it's it's just, uh, you know, it kind of gets me upset because it's like he's trying to put that put that on you where trying to make you look like the bad guy uh, where, you know, you're throwing at someone on purpose, kind of put a bad name out there. And But, you know, that's not me. Um, I'm out here just trying to win for my team, uh, you know, put up zeros, and, and that's it.